I'm doing pop culture, entertainment, things like that. As you can see here, this is Piers Morgan's Twitter account. It's got 8.3 million followers, but actually there's nothing there because the account has been hacked. Now, right now, I don't see anything coming up. No comments, no replies, no nothing. But before this happened, I actually took a few screenshots that I want to go over and just take a look at what some people are tweeting out from his account or whoever took it over. I don't know details yet, but I do know what was going on as far as what was being tweeted without his knowledge. So if I go to tweets and replies here, nothing comes up, show more, something went wrong is going to come up or something like that. Just a list of people, whatever it is. Tweets, again, show more. I don't see the actual tweets. Looks like people I'm following or similar or whatever it is. Media. All right. Nothing really. Likes. Looks like things he liked possibly are still there. But that's about it for now. So here's my slideshow from before the current state it's in now. And it's from December 27th. It says breaking news. Andrew Tate has been found shot dead in Dubai, which obviously is not correct. Andrew Tate himself replied and said, hard to kill or something. So this probably tipped people off to the fact that it was not Piers Morgan. Plus, there's no profile pic anymore. And the first person down there says, it's been a while since I've seen a big name hacked like this. Claiborne says, it's been a while since he's been a big name. Okay. It's big enough, big enough. 8.3 million followers. I've never heard of the dude. I have. Okay. Oh man, I got my hopes up. Elon Musk, please help Piers, he's been hacked. And here you can see obviously something I'd rather not talk about. However, somebody tweeted out from Piers Morgan's account, the N-word. Just the N-word. That's it. So, obviously, I don't think someone on his level would just tweet that out. Seems like someone hacked it and did that. And obviously in caps you could see plenty of people saying, this account got hacked, please fix it. Holy S-H-I-T, I thought this was legit. Dubai ain't effing Chicago where people get shot randomly. Talking about the fake Andrew Tate news. That's what you get for having I love Megan as your password. Okay. No, his password is Ronald is my goat or something like that. Piers Morgan got hacked. One more of those. Uh, Piers, your account is hacked, bro. So as I read down, I just saw comment after comment that it was hacked. At first, I didn't know... But it does seem legit. Seems like someone got in there. We've got no idea who at this point. Could be his wife. Could be his, I don't know, one of his kids playing a joke. Who the heck knows. But it doesn't seem like it's him. Well, I mean, it's not. Again, he's been hacked. So this one looks like was his old profile pic. And he says, I like sucking on the top G's. You know what. And people call Andrew Tate the top G. I guess because he recently had an interview with Andrew Tate. So people are kind of rolling with that. Laugh out loud. Poor old Piers. His account has been hacked. What's going on? Is this Morgan or what? And I do not think so. All right. This is the last screenshot I got before the whole thing kind of went haywire. Is he playing? He's been hacked. My account was hacked a few months ago and Twitter did nothing about it. Hopefully they do nothing here too. So not everyone's a fan of Piers. And I know not everyone on this channel is a fan of Piers. I'm kind of in the middle. He does say things I agree with, but then again, sometimes it seems like he's just pressing buttons, trying to piss people off, trying to get ratings or whatever it is, views, clickbait, that kind of thing. So I see that side of him that people don't like. I don't know. I'm just neutral. But I do find this kind of interesting and funny. Anyway, let me know what you think down below. Doing shout outs, special thanks. I'm on Twitter too. Maybe give me a follow, trying to get to 3,000 followers. And if you're not subscribed here on the channel, consider it. And if you don't subscribe, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.